Take my water with Do me. that, yes. All right. <laughs> Come on over. We're going to go to the mailbox. We asked the uh, question. Our today's special is our improvements, uh, beautiful fencing. So the question was, if you bought our today's special, uh, where are you? Up above me? <laughs> if you bought our today's special, uh, where would you use it? And you can win $25. So here's our answers. I've got, I got Lindy Ann that says, my husband's, my husband stores his snowmobile next to my garden shed. I could use that to block and cover that. Good idea. Lisa says, I live in a double house. I would put them on my front porch to divide the porches. That's smart. Kathy says, where you are? There, Kathy says, hi, Kathy. Uh, ladies outdoor shower. There you go. I told you. Uh, my sweet Anita says, I would use uh, my, my uh, today's special. Uh, to put it on my chain link fence to hide my neighbor's nightmare of a yard. <laughs> so, and of course, my beautiful Martina, I'm thinking of getting a set to replace the ones I have. I can swap them out whenever I want to change the color. Good idea because we have these beautiful colors in our today's special. We will keep you posted and let you know uh, who's winning uh, and who's going to win. Okay. You remember before I said my Father's Day pick of the year? Do you remember these uh, when we were kids? I do. The retro old school coolers. Well, Improvements has given us one that is brand new, got brand new features all lined inside. Fill it with ice, load it full of your favorite beverage. It's got a pop place for your, uh, for your bottle caps. This reminds me of the old candy store I used to go to when I was a kid. You'd lift up one of the bins and you'd pull a soda out. You have dual bins. It's so beautifully made and it's on rollers. So if you want to take it camping, I said for dad, for Father's Day, he'll love this. I would love to get this. It is on sale. It comes in red. It comes in black. And the one that I'm going to buy is stainless steel. I love that classic stainless. I like the red, too. It reminds me of a very famous cooler that you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, 823-759 is the item number there. And my big pick, <clears throat> what if I told you I can take any garden hose 50, 60 PSI and crank it up to 360 PSI. And I could do that cordless with the Sunjo portable cordless power sprayer. This thing is ridiculous. It's almost like taking your regular hose without having to put your thumb over it and you get a powered sprayer. By the way, you can use your garden hose, but it also comes with a siphon tube. You can drop that in, in a, a five uh, gallon bucket of water. You can drop it in the harbor, <laughs> in your pool, and you can use it without a connected water source other than contained water. It's absolutely brilliant. But want to get to our best value of the day. If you need to beautify anything, hide anything, make your house look pretty, get our today's special. Here we go. Yeah. <clears throat> I said earlier, I don't care what kind of space you got, you can beautify any space and you can do it instantly with our today's special. Over 10,000 gone, <clears throat> whether you just need privacy or you're trying to, you know, make something that's not so good looking look a little bit better, how about a lot of bit better, ready to go right out of the box for your deck, your patio, your pool area. You can hide your trash or recycle bins. What if you've got an air conditioning unit, you wanna hide that? What if you've got a hideously nasty looking yeah, chain leak fence. And you're like, oh my gosh, what am I? I don't want to live in a prison. What is that? That is hideous. Take our today's special and instantly beautify any space in your yard, on your property, just like that. It's all you need to do. And I can adjust it up or down. It's totally flexible. So I can accommodate any space. We are offering them today for $39.95. This is lavender, violet, excuse me. Uh, it's because you were wearing a lavender shirt this morning. That's why I keep saying lavender. We also have it available <clears throat> in green. It comes available in ivory. And then the one all the way down on the end, that is our beautiful soft pink. Anybody can get one today. If you get a brand new HSN credit card, we'll give you $40 in your account. And you can buy this and only pay a little shipping, a little handling, and a little tax. But everybody wants this. Deb Byers, come on out. Tell us about it. Well. Love it. I, well, apparently so do an awful lot of you. <laughs> this is the gorgeous expandable fence 
blooming. You've got gorgeous flowers over the entire thing. You've still got the same expandability that you know and love. This is going to come to you in a box. It'll be a foot and a half high by four feet. And then you just decide how low can you go or how high you can go with this gorgeous fence. The same beautiful bamboo rods on the back that are going to give you that gorgeous lattice. But because we have the blooms, and this happens to be the ivory one, everyone, look at how beautiful it is. It's got the touches of green and then the ivy, uh, the ivory color, and they're hanging down. So there's a lot of lushness in this. So it's not like you're going to be trying to hide something and you're going to see these huge gaps. It is so lush. And if you're using this as a shade between you and your neighbor and you're enjoying the gorgeous blooms, when we turn it around, the other side has got the beautiful bamboo rod lattice work. <clears throat> and then because of the way that these are hung and they are hand tied on all all the bamboo so it's not like they're stapled or nailed or whatever the flowers pop through so your neighbor is going to see this gorgeous lattice and then the flowers as well so it's a win-win-win if you want to go ahead and use this as a privacy fence but the hardest thing that you need to do is think about which one of these four gorgeous colors you're going to get yeah. <clears throat> how many you're going to get and where are you going to put them because they're great indoors and outdoors to give you that beautiful touch of spring all year round you know we buy a house and we hope it's going to be perfect in every way but you know you have neighbors and sometimes the neighbors you maybe don't take care of their property as well as you do yep. or maybe you've got a garbage can a recycle bin and it's right there next to your deck and everybody can see it when they drive by your house you can conceal that anything that you want to hide i i've actually have it in the lower area of my deck it blocks that little crawl space out because i can take it and I can shrink it down to this size, and I'll show you. And I can put this under under the, the crawl space on the deck right on the ground, just like that. I've got a couple of them that do that. If I wanna make it a little bit taller for my outdoor shower, I can do that. Now, if I get two of them, I've got a completely enclosed shower, and as you can see, I've got that, I've got that security, I've got that privacy, right? So it's what you make of it. We've got one behind us, and I'm gonna walk back here real okay. quick. And we actually put this in our pergola. We got a couple of them back here. We actually have a way to block out some of the sun's rays. So we actually put it right here and Deb, it just, it's hanging, it's like cascading, it's beautiful. It's absolutely gorgeous, Guy. It almost looks like Tuscany. You can imagine the look of grapes hanging down, but it's giving you the shade, it's giving you the beauty, and it, most importantly, that was super easy to do. Yeah. We just needed someone to climb up there and drop it up there to create that stunning, designer look, look. Beautiful those are your expandable fences with the blooms oh. it couldn't get more beautiful than that look at how gorgeous and and we've uh, we've immediately given this depth we've given it charm and you never have to babysit it you don't have to water it you can wash it off if it gets dusty you can wash it off with a hose there's no maintenance it's meant to be outdoors all right yeah if you want to put it inside somewhere if you want to use it for something you could but this is meant to be outside to cover an area maybe that you don't want, that you don't like the look of. You know, we buy a house or a property, we're kind of stuck with what's there. So all we can really do is kind of just change it up a little bit. Um, most people will put this uh, maybe in an area of their pool. Maybe if you live in an apartment or a condo and you don't have any privacy out on your deck, put it outside right? Totally. And you're bringing mother nature in. So Look if you don't have yeah. mother nature, particularly if you're sitting in a condo and actually we can get over there because I want everybody to see. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and show everybody sure. how amazing it can be. If you're living in a, an apartment or you're living in a condo, excuse me, and you don't have a backyard. Well, we can create that look with a fence because what this fence will do well, we have a condo, we're in a condo, we're on the eighth floor, and it's a beautiful little, just a small area, we love it, we love sitting outside, but through the, the fence that they put up on here to protect us from falling over the ledge, we're seeing the parking lot. Yeah. So now every time I come out here for coffee, I'm looking at other people's cars, but not anymore. Now we have added the beauty of the fence, and this is the gorgeous ivory. We attached it with the 12 zip ties that you get. Super, super easy. And now something that was unsightly not only becomes beautiful, but it gives us back the space and gives us the opportunity to have a little bit of mother nature on the eighth floor of our <coughs> condo. So think about having something that's going to hide something unsightly, Look but adds so 
much and beauty. It's, it's just one fence. It's so plush. I mean, honestly, when you run your hands through it, it feels like a real shrub. It does. I honestly does. It doesn't feel plasticky. It feels like a shrub because they did. The, they took the time to put so much texture. No, no two are alike, right? They're all a little bit different. Yes. And they're nice and thick. The perfect amount. So what, no matter what area it is that you're trying to, to hide or cover or just enhance, you're gonna get the look of a real plant. Most popular is the ivory right here or the green. And I said earlier in our earlier show, if you're looking for one and you don't know what color to get, I would either get ivory or green, most neutral, easiest one. And those are the two that are on the right of your screen as you're looking at it. So you have that natural green and then you have a little bit of color with the ivory. But if you wanna make something pop, go right ahead and use the pink. I mean, Deb, this is your house. That's my yard. That's a regular plain fence. That's eight feet by six feet. And I ran the pink one across the top and then moved my plants forward. So yeah. it really looks like a real, uh, almost like a Japanese cherry blossom. It's so extraordinary. And the violet. Now, when we're done here, I want you to look up wisteria and look for that color because the mother nature gives us that gorgeous violet and the inter the impersonments team wanted you to have that same color. So that's what that violet is, is a true wisteria, wisteria purple. And then what I did, I had two of the ivory, so I put them one on top of the other and filled out that entire eight by six foot wall to create something that's ivy cutter, cottage, like an ivy covered cottage that. with no maintenance, no, no trimming, no fertilizing, no watering. The only water that's gonna get on it is the rain and that's okay. But you're gonna be able to hang this up and enjoy them right out of the box. and. Believe Believe me, mm. you're going to enjoy them because they're that beautiful. When, when you were Skyping from home, I remember you always had one of these in your yep. backdrop. Yep. Because it just gives you, it gives it texture, it gives it character. Now, I will tell you right now, if you want to get this home, $13 to get it home. Don't buy one, buy two. You're going to want two, if you can afford it. All right, if you, if you have a small space, you just need one, I'm good with that. But I would tell you to get two because I, I made the mistake of buying one, I needed another one, I had to wait a year before we had them back mm -hmm. in stock. And those were just the originals. These are much fuller. They're a little bit denser in the amount and clustering of leaves and more, and they're way more colorful. Um, but get it home. Uh, if you get a brand new HSN credit card, we'll give you $40. You can get one for almost free. Pay a little shipping and handling and tax. Deb, will you show everybody the big sort of ta-da? <laughs> I love this Because part. I have said that most people, you know, everybody that has a home or an apartment, a recycling area, right? Or a garbage area. Absolutely. We all have something that we want to hide and what we've done here is we've got two that's why guy is saying if you can manage it to get a couple because then you've got so much more versatility of how you're going to use them so all we did was took two of them you're getting 12 zip ties so with two of them you're getting 24 zip ties we created a right angle right here and now they're freestanding so they look beautiful they're giving you that gorgeous look this is that beautiful pink but wait what are we hiding we're hiding a big old garbage can and this is a giant one so think about the things in your yard or garden that you really want to hide and now you have something that's not only going to hide them but make beautiful the space so think about whether you've got an air conditioner or you've got recycling or you've got a big old garbage can or you want to keep the dog from barking at the delivery guy whatever your issue is it can be addressed with these gorgeous fences and with the blooms. By the way, I know you probably noticed the beautiful wreaths that we have up here. We have these available in the same colors yes. as we do with our, uh, with our fencing. So if you want to get, I've never seen one so dense. You know, you buy the, the artificial wreaths at the store and they're really thin. This is incredibly thick. If you wanted to put little Easter decorations in here for Easter, if you wanted to put holiday lights on there, perfect for a front door perfect for a picture window there's even little clips so you can put it on your chimney if you want to put it on you know on, on brick and we'll put the number for those little brick clips up there as well but Lo these are gorgeous. gorgeous and we have all the colors to choose from they're beautiful and again they're weather resistant and fade resistant so go ahead and proudly put that on your front door to introduce your guests to your home and you never have to worry about them again but to guy's point they lend themselves to being decorated but most importantly they're bringing spring to you spring yeah. is right around the corner you're going to be able to have that right away right out of the box with any of these items from improvements because
because they're that beautiful and that much and that natural looking. Also available, we're gonna walk over. Deb, would you go over by the spheres? Excuse me, I would so be we happy have, to. We have two of our floral spheres, which uh, are available as well for $49.95. I think these are fantastic. They're kind of like that boxwood look to them. Whether you hang them like we've got them, or Deb, will you show them in a pot? Sure. These so are we, fantastic. So what you're gonna do, you're getting two of them. They're 13 inches. They are like boxwood, but they're the same colors as your fences. All you do when you get them, is give them a little zhuzh to get the little, the, all the, the leaves and all the branches out, and then you pop them in a pot. They're that simple and you have just decorated. Or we've got these hung. We have two of them hung on a shepherd's hook. They only weigh about three pounds. This is just regular fishing line, so you don't have to yeah. spend a lot of money to get a high-end decorator look. But we love having them flanking your door. You can hang them on fish, uh, fishing hook in yeah. your garden. Wherever you put them, you're going to be able to enjoy they, them. They look like a hanging topiary. They look right? exactly like, like Mystical that. topiary. By the way, those are the clips. And Deb, you said I can put these on my chimney? You, no, if you like, have, I, I have on brick bricks, on the outside, yeah. If you have bricks, you can totally use these. So what they do is you don't have to drill, you don't have to nail anything. You're gonna ruin your mortar. They're clips that fit on the bottom and then you simply push them over the top. There are two little hooks there so you can hang your Christmas lights. They'll hold 25 pounds. They're not permanent, but they are secure. So hang them proudly outside your home for a mailbox or maybe a flag or maybe a wreath or whatever you want. And then when you're ready to take them off, just pop them off and yeah. they're good to go. You're getting 20 of them. Totally use them for the team. Yes, because like remember, that. you could hang it on the zip ties and then loop them onto your uh, your your brick clips. Yeah. They're amazing if you have bricks in your home. They're going to be the answer to They have to little everything. teeth on top, so they sit on top of the brick just like that, and then you can hang whatever it is on the outside. These are brilliant. They are yeah. totally brilliant, and they're, uh, you're getting 20 of them, so think about all the ways that you're gonna be hanging everything. And again, you can hang the TS on a beautiful brick wall. In the past, you'd have to nail it and maybe make permanent holes that are making a mistake or chip your bricks. No more, these are the answer. They're just that great. I love the flexibility of being able to go set, uh, left to right or up and down, right? Because for a lot of us, it may be a fence, for some of us, it may be a, a, a more of a vertical space, right? Where we need to go up or down, or because we're, we're kind of showing them sort of horizontally. But what's nice about these, Deb, is that we can go up or we can go down. If you wanted to go up, you can go like that. So like, remember before I said about an outdoor shower? You'd want to spin it on its side and go up. <clears throat> but if you want to go somewhere on the ground, you turn it, you know, just that, that one turn, and then you can stretch it as long as you need. So. If you've got a big area in the front of your yard that you want to uh, expand on, you'd probably get three or four of these and you'd cover the whole thing. Like under my deck, I wound up getting three of them, two for the side and one for the front. I didn't need to put it on the back because that's where the steps are. Of so course. I was like, but I'll tell you, it looks so much better. I don't worry that there's things crawling underneath the deck all the time. And it literally took 10 minutes to do the whole job. Well, and that's yeah. the thing. These are ready to go right out of the box. When they come to you, the box is gonna be about a foot and a half wide and four feet high. And then all you need to do is slide it out of the box. At the bottom of the box in a bag will be this 12 zip ties. So remember, you can adhere it to any wall. You can, they're lightweight enough to use a nail or a hook, but we give you the zip ties. So if you're going to affix them to a chain link fence or something like that, you definitely want to utilize them. But then all you need to do is decide how you're going to hang it, whether you want to do it horizontally or you want to do it vertically. And think about, you know, we love the look of an ivy covered cottage, but a trellis takes a long time to grow so it requires a lot of attention oh, yeah. maintenance for trimming fertilizing all kinds of stuff and bugs and you don't want to have that this is going to give you that beautiful trellis look literally out of the box I can't stress that enough and they look so real so if you're looking for something that's going to create the kind of curb appeal that you did with the ones that you put under your deck yeah. this is going to do I'm it put them together and show you now this is two of them so as we said if you're trying to, c to cover a large space. And then Deb, would you, let, let's turn it so we can show how you would form that partition. So here's how I would do the shower, right? Put one on one side, now we're using the different colors, but there, now I have got a completely enclosed area. A great shot from above, thanks guys. So if you wanted to do just a little cozy spot where you can shower, that is all that you would need to do. They really are so easy to work with. Yes. And the construction of them is so good. Yes. Because you know, we're, we're twisting these things around and running them all over the place. Nothing's coming off. You don't see any leaves falling off. You don't see any breaks. They're flexible. So if you need to move it around a corner, 
You can flex them a little bit. They're not meant to be bent, but you can move it. So if you are going around a softer corner, you can use these for that as well. Well, the, the, the reason why they are so flexible are they are made with bamboo rods. These are genuine bamboo rods, and all of the beautiful flowers are woven on with, with, the, uh, with, the, with the wire on the bamboo rods. So we didn't just staple them and glue them and all that stuff so that they fall off. They're woven just like Mother Nature. But the best part is these, there's no ugly side to this fence. So if you are using it as a, a privacy fence between you and a neighbor, yeah. Again, you're, you're going to be able to enjoy the beautiful flowers on the front. And your neighbor is going to see the backside, which is the bamboo rods with yeah. the flowers popping through. There's nobody that's going to get upset when you decide that you just can't stand your neighbor anymore. And then you put this fence up because it's so beautiful. They're going to go, hey, buddy, fence it off a lot. You, know, you made my house look great. Have you seen the cheap version of this? At the store? You know, I have. And I'm it's just funny saying, to know, I, I have. There, is a, there are a couple of versions of this. One that just rolls out, doesn't even have any stability. You're just laying it on top yes. of, a, of an existing fence, in which case you can't move it. You can't adjust it. You got to cut it. You don't have to do any of that. You take this out of the box, ready to go. Expand it vertically or horizontally to the space that you want to customize and attach it. It's that easy. All right, and it's not, you know, the bamboo is everything. I'm telling you, I, as much as I love the color and the quality of the, uh, of the foliage that's on here, this bamboo is really what keeps the whole thing together. It's the structural integrity of it. That's what makes ours different, is that ours is going to last. Ours doesn't look fake, all right? Theirs does. And ours, the neighbor will be pleased because this is what they're seeing. It's not chain, it's real bamboo. And re bamboo is a renewable resource. It grows yes. very, very fast. So you're also not, we're not using regular trees to make this. So, exactly. Yeah. There's no question about it. But I want to take this, I want to show everybody, is it possible to show everybody how beautiful it is on the pergola? Yeah, go and ahead. I, I'm going to walk over there and I'm going to take this with me. Look at that. Now, what we did is, if you're fortunate enough to have a pergola, what we did is put two of them on top of that and then they hang down. So you're getting the blooms are hanging down like you're in Tuscany or out in Napa Valley. It's so rich and so gorgeous. And all that we did was hang two of them. We just rested two of them up there, affixed them with the zip ties to get that really high-end designer look. So you have nothing but options of how you want to beautify your home or hide something. And that we didn't do anything special, but put them up there because the way that the flowers are affixed to the fence, they hang down so when you have them when you have it vertically they're simply hanging down but look at how gorgeous that is that is so high and I absolutely love it thank you guys that's a spectacular shot absolutely at, spectacular at, it actually looks like it's coming through it's great because You've actually got about three to four to five inch of um, sort of drape on this. yes it's, it's exactly right yes. it's exactly right Look at that. I know, it's spectacular. I, you know, it, it, you said Tuscany, and I wish, I, it, one day I will go to Italy, but it's like, why not create that own little world in your backyard? Exactly. Why not do that? And we're not asking you to spend two or three hundred dollars, all right? I would get two or three of these, you're at about a hundred bucks, and you've instantly transformed your property. If you have a fence, if you have a, you know, a, a gated area that you're like, you know, I've never been crazy about the metal, cover it with this. If you want to create your own little private outdoor shower, maybe you've got a swimming pool with a really hideous swimming pool fence. And you're like, I'm going to put that all the way around the pool. It grows all year, mm -hmm. right? It's I never true. have to water it. It's true. It's always green or purple or pink. Gorgeous, right? It's 100% true. And you don't need to have a green thumb. So I don't have a green thumb. That's why I love having these in my yard. My plants, unfortunately, they look at me and go, what are you doing to us, Deborah?" But we have these gorgeous fence, uh, fences in our home because we love the look. It gives everything a finished look. And you're not spending a lot of money to have a high-end look. Remember, we just showed you something that lets you feel like you might be in Tuscany. But this is going to give you that look inside your home as well. Because one of the aspects of it is if you go to any restaurant, any uh, open space, or any mall, any public space, they all now have these walls of flowers and greenery. They're very Insta 
photographing, you know, your friends yeah. and family in front of. Some sure. of them have neon on them, but they're really lush. You can recreate that look in your home. Hang it horizontally, hang it vertically, hang it on a nail. You get the zip ties. We had a customer who said she used it as a headboard in her bedroom. Hey. Imagine this gorgeous pink as a headboard. Oh, my, but that would be fabulous. But you've got that option, inside or out, all year wrong, no green thumb, no maintenance at all, right out of the box, and you are in charge of how you hang it, and it's never permanent, you can move it wherever you like. Nothing to put together? No. Literally, and I will show you, this is how it's packed inside the box, okay? It's in a thin box like that. Take it out, you open it up. Uh, you basically go out and maybe measure the area that you want, figure out what you need, length times width, and then all you do with this is just put it out there. In fact, you don't even need to measure. Just take this outside and stretch it till it fits, and then lock it into place, and then attach it with the twist ties. That's all you need to do. Right? You could even use those those clips if you want to put it on brick. You could, you could do that as you well. You could totally do that. Yeah. That's really great. So remember those bricks. If you've got bricks, you want the brick clips. But what I love that you just did, Guy, is if you have a garden and your garden is up against your house and your flowers aren't in yet, line this up on the back of your house. Put your flowers in the front. When springtime comes, the blooms are going to pop up and you're going to have your gorgeous fence as a backdrop to enhance it. And the flowers will work back to the fence because they are that natural looking. You can't go wrong in any one of these gorgeous right. colors to create, enhance, and hide. What would Look you rather that. have? That in front of your property? I mean, that just says keep out. Angry. You know, that's angry. Okay? Well, let's do the same thing, but let's make it nice. All right? That's nice. Look at that difference. We have just taken a basically industrial you know, fence that should be, you know, in a stockyard somewhere or, you know, or, or, or at the dump. And we've taken it and we've, we've lightened it. We've made it look soft. We've made it look pretty. This is the uh, uh, violet. Yes, violet. Oh, tough time with that violet I know, today, I know right? you do. I know, I don't know understand. what the heck it is. That is violet. Stretch it so it fits. There you go. I love, I love that demo. That's a great demo. We also have it available. I'm gonna move the, uh, this is the pink. So we've got them all over the place. Very popular is the natural green. Uh, if you're on the fence, and I don't mean that, you know, well, I guess I mean that literally and figuratively. Uh, I would go with the traditional green or I would go with the ivory. Those are, those are basically the best sort of softer ways to kind of add color. And you may not want color. Now, if you do like the color and you're like, oh, I got the perfect place for that, right? You want to use that pink for your uh, garbage area because you're like, you know what? I'm going to tell that garbage it's okay. It's all right to be nasty because you're covered in a beautiful pink thing of shrubs. You can go that color. I love that right there. Because this guy's like, you know what? I want a little privacy. So we put it right along that chain link fence. This lady here is out on her patio. I don't want everybody looking at me. He's got a dead space next to his uh, slider. There's down at the dock. I mean, where can you not use it? Well, that's the thing. You're just limited by your imagination. If you've got a plain blank wall, you now have a beautiful flowering wall. If you have a beautiful area that you just want to enhance, you now have something that can do it for you. Whether you use it long, low, and absolutely gorgeous. And when you extend it all the way down, it'll go to about nine feet Look at by that. about a foot and a half. And you can do this by yourself. So while I'm down here, this is going to give you that gorgeous look that Guy got with under his deck to keep the critters out yeah. and to give you that curb appeal. Think about how easy this is. And you do it, you know, it takes five minutes and suddenly you've Deb, got something that what looks about, this gorgeous. I'll wait till we get back to that other shot. I want to show everybody one more time. We'll go back, leave it right there, Deb. Okay. What about just on your sidewalk? Right, or on your on walkway. On edging your sidewalk. Just, just edge out your walkway, and now you've got that little tiny, like little about 10 inch hedge. You get two or three or four of these, you could line the whole property. Now you've got this sculpted walkway Gorgeous. that you never have to trim. Absolutely. Never have to water, never have to cut. And it, it takes your property from here and it just elevates it, it up totally to here. Does. It totally does. Yeah. There's no question about it. And I love what you said. If you go to any of those big stores, they have these and they're, the, it's one color, it's twice the price. They're not beautiful. You're getting beautiful. Because remember, these are from improvements. These are the expandable fence that's blooming. We worked very, very hard to give you those gorgeous colors and the natural looking colors to give you something that's going to enhance your spring and summer experience and then all year 
around. And just look at that pergola, how gorgeous it looks when it's up on top. And again, we just got a ladder. We placed them on their face side down and those beautiful flowers just droop about three or four inches to give you that look. Look, there's my, can you see my hand? I don't know where, well, I'm trying to figure out what shot you're getting. <laughs> that might be recorded. Um, but look, I'm underneath it and we don't have a super duper sunny day, but that will give you some color from the sun. It'll give you a little privacy. It's like, I love to go to Universal and whenever I go to Universal with Danny, and, and you know, we, pr we bring, sometimes he brings Lily. I always get a cabana. Of I'm course. like, you gotta have a cabana. This is like your own little private little area where you can have a glass of wine. Could be out on your porch. Anywhere where you wanna block something out, get privacy, add, you know, some a more discreet space. That's what you can do with these. And Deb, I think we only have two up here. There's only two up there. Two up here. But Guy, yeah. look at the beauty that that is providing. And remember, we're also using Cozy. it to hide garbage cans. So that's how versatile these fences are. From something that's strictly decorative to something that's totally utilitarian. Either way, it's adding beauty and practicality to your, to your home instantly right out of the box. I'm over here with just what you were talking about. Yep. If you only buy it, to hide your garbage and your recycle, you're doing the whole neighborhood a big favor, right? <laughs> well, because most of our garbage and recycle bins are in the front of our house near yes. the curb, so we don't have to wheel them 300 yards, right? You would never know that I'm, I'm smuggling a garbage can back here, right? It could be my recycles. What a great way to be able to hide those. And remember, not only are you doing yourself a favor, you're doing the neighborhood a favor. Nobody wants to look at a, you know, and my, my recycle bin's that bright blue and the garbage is green. It's just, everybody knows that it's garbage. So if you don't want that and you want it to look pretty, this is the way to go. All right, we're gonna spend about four or five minutes on our beautiful decorative wreaths. And I will tell you, Improvements does it better than anybody else out there, Deb, because they really put a lot of effort into it. Oh, yes. So well made. Uh, whether you're using them just to brighten any space for spring and summer, or whether you're using them for holiday, a special event, right? You can decorate them any way you want. I said before, Easter, uh, wh wh whatever holidays you celebrate, you can put different colored lights on here. And they will be as beautiful now as they will five years from now. Never change. They will never change. They're 21 inches. They weigh about just under two pounds. They are lush, lush, lush. And they work thick. back to the fences. So if you want to have the complete look, get the wreath for your front door or to hang in a window or to hang on a wall anywhere in your home. They are spectacularly beautiful, very lightweight, very easy to hang. And to Guy's point, they will lend themselves to holiday decorating. So think about bows, think about lights, think about you know Christmas balls or whatever. But most importantly, when you put this on your front door and your friends come in, it's a way of saying, you are welcome in my home. I want you to have beauty and this is what I've got to offer you. And you will not be wrong, they will totally appreciate it. Picture window, right, front door. Uh, I actually, I'm gonna use those brick clips and I'm gonna put one on, I put one on my chimney when it's holiday time. I love right? that. The, the brick chips, the brick clips are amazing and they'll be a great way for you to go ahead and hang this if you have bricks on the wall. If you have regular you know, walls and it's all good, you just use a nail or a hook, you, no problem. They're very, very lightweight. But these are going to be absolutely stunning on a front door. If you have the fences and you wanna go ahead and have them match, by all means have them match or mix it up. All four of the colors will work back to one another. They're all spectacular, all so gorgeous. Now, we don't have it on a front door you're looking at the ivory behind us we just went ahead and put it on a plain fence and look how spectacular it is in the ivory look at look how at beautiful it that is, is in the that's pink the one, that, i would get the ivory I I, I I think the ivory i love that right there but if you want to pop a color like for instance maybe you've got a house that's a certain color that you want to add some pop maybe you got a white house you're like oh i would really love the pink on that house or the purple Right, if you have, the purple would be great if you had like a gray, grayish color, sort of a yes. wood tone house. All these different, and if you just want to go generic, you can go with the regular one that just kind of looks like a regular holiday wreath, right? But Deb, they're so thick. 
They're flush. And, and just like the spheres we were talking about and just like the fences, we are not making them like so sheer that they look ridiculous. We want them to look as natural as possible. So some of the branches are longer, some of the branches are shorter. Yeah. So they just look like the blooms are mother nature, the way that mother nature intended them. And if you're getting that green, you've got variations of green. So it's not just green, it's just green and green and green. So you've got all those blended colors. And on the bright color that I've got here, the pink, when you see it up close, when you get it at home, you'll see it's green underneath and then there's the pink, like just real, like mother, like just real, like yeah. the real mother nature. Yeah. So you're getting that density. That's what gives us this beautiful lushness. It's not just pink, it's pink with green, just the way mother nature intended. All right, and we also spectacular. Have, yeah, we also have the spheres, which are on the other side of Deb up there. If you want to get uh, two, uh, two pack of the spheres, you can hang those, you can put them in pots. They, they're gorgeous, they look like box, boxwoods, except they're a heck of a lot easier to maintain. Never have to water them. So if you don't have to be a lazy gardener, all right, that, that's not what I'm saying, but maybe you don't have time and you want pretty, but you don't have time to, to dig and do all that stuff. These are perfect for that. Same with our today's special. Uh, Deb Byers, we're got, not going anywhere. Oh no, we've got one so more surprise. We have a, it's my Father's Day pick. I want to get one. I got to, maybe Danny will buy me one. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> uh, that's coming up before we get to that. We've got live plants available on hsn.com, and guess what we're doing? All free shipping and handling. So if you want to get your plants, now's the time to stock up. We're going to step away. When we come back, we got lots more great stuff coming your way. It's time for spring and the Garden Shop, a week-long series here to gorgeous up your garden with five days' worth of outdoor must-haves, plus tips, tricks, and garden essentials. The Garden Shop, all week, starting May 1st at 5 p.m., only on HSN. Food has always been my passion, but the truth is, even in the world's best kitchens, the tools can really make or break a chef. That's why I've developed this incredible, innovative line for HSN. Let's turn the everyday into gourmet. It's Customer Appreciation Month, and it's all about you. For the entire month of April, we're showing the love to our HSN Card VIPs with exclusive perks like VIP Tuesdays. Get a special offer every Tuesday in April, plus extra flex on every item under $369 all day every day, or VIP financing on so many items. Not a card member? Apply now and instantly get $40 off when you're approved. Visit hsn.com slash hsncard or call 1-800-695-1418 or D Details on our exclusive VIP offers. Thank you for being an HSN Card VIP. Tune in to Celebrity Hot List, a day of star-studded programming dedicated to your most loved celebrity brands, including Jessica Simpson, Christian Siriano, Joanna Garcia Swisher, Juliana Rancic, and the premiere of TPA Chair Care by Taraji P. Henson. It's a full day of incredible offers, hot new styles for you and your home, insider tips, plus special programs. Celebrity Hot List starts Thursday at midnight, only on HSN. Again, and I'm a Steadicam operator here at HSN. Our customers affect what I do every single day, especially as a Steadicam operator. I'm always looking to bring dynamic angles and creative looks to a show, and I'm always thinking to myself, if I was a customer, what do I want to know about this product? And I try to emphasize that. For me, one of the biggest highlights about working at HSN has been becoming a, a really integral part of HSN today. I love working with Tina and Ty. They're absolute goofballs, and they're hilarious on set. It's easy for them, and easy for us to play off that because they're like that in real life. Just working that show is an absolute joy and I look forward to coming to work every day because of that. I help create the inspiring television that you watch every day. Thank you. We appreciate you more than you know. Deb is back with me and we got something really special. I looked at you this, this morning when we were talking about the show and I said, that rolling cooler cart is probably one of the coolest things I've ever seen. It reminds me so much uh, there was a place called Candy Kitchen when we were kids, and the owner had one of these like in the corner, and it was always full of sodas, and it was always there, and it's even got, look, even has a little pop top. 
Got the little can opener right there. Inside, you've got dual bins, so you can load this up. It is completely insulated. I have, Deb's gonna tell you all the different features. I have it available in the stainless steel, okay? I have it available in the red, which is, I mean, a really great retro red. And then it also comes in black. It is on wheels. I said Father's Day because I don't know of a dad out there that wouldn't want to have this thing stocked out on the deck full of whatever dad's favorite beverage is or mom's favorite beverage. But I love the dual access. Tell us all about it. I know we only had, a, what do we have, about 800, Andre? Huh. I said, what do we have, about 800 of these? So we have about 150 of each. That's it. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, so I'll talk really, really fast. Yeah. Well, you know, the summer is here. We're going to be doing Father's Day, which is what Guy wants. He wants this for Father's Day, so we've got to let Danny know. You've got Memorial Day. You've got the 4th of July. You've got Labor Day. Then we're heading into the holidays, so don't think that this is going to be going away during the holidays. This is a cooler with an 80-quart capacity, and it'll hold roughly 70 aluminum no. cans. So if you're using this for the, beer, the, the man cave, we got you covered. It weighs about 42 pounds. It'll hold 132 pounds. It's about three feet across, three feet high, and 15 inches across. It's made of stainless steel construction, Ugh. all powder coated. You've got heavy duty caster wheels with locks on two of them to keep it secure, handles to make it easy to move, and that dual opening at Look the at top, this. the hinge oh. opening, which allows you to fill this to your heart content with your favorite beverages on ice and again because it is fully insulated and a stainless steel construction that ice isn't going to melt but should you be ready to take to finish it all off and you're all done you don't have to tip this over there's a drain right here at the back so all you need to open it oh, is yeah. let the drain go out and have a, a just be totally clean wipe it down and it's good to go to the next party but this is going to be your bff for clean ice for your beverages to keep all your beverages is cold whether it's beer or soda or over the holidays champagne ladies so think about this for new year's eve it's not just for dad and the man cave also it lends itself to guy's point like the old ice cream coolers from back in the day have an ice cream party if you've got kids how fun would it be to fill this with ice and ice cream and let the kids enjoy it because it's like in by my day we had an ice cream freezer and you're down in your elbow scooping out the ice cream it comes with the cap remover and the cap holder. The two handles can double for a place for your grilling supplies or towels. And this is gonna be fantastic if you're grilling because you can put your cold, uncooked food on oh, ice man. and then grill and then use it as a place to insert your <clears throat> patters when you're done grilling. So it's gonna be super versatile if you're entertaining for a big party or an intimate party. This is going to be absolutely your best it friend. Just, and it has a shelf on the bottom for extra supplies. Yeah, so you can put all your, you can put, you can put a case of beer underneath when absolutely. you want to, uh, you know, switch it in and out. So I've got about 475 of these to go around. It is on sale today. It was 247. They dropped it to 219. They dropped the shipping because I know this is expensive to ship down to seven dollars and fifty cents. It does have locking caster wheels, so when you want to lock it into place, I'm stuck. I don't know if I want the red or the silver. <laughs> well, the silver, the red reminds me of a certain brand. Yes, we all and, know. You know yeah, and, and that I would tell you, but the silver reminds me of the one that this guy had in this. It was called the Candy Kitchen. I remember his name. It was, it was it was called. We called it Candy Kitchen because he had tons of candy. Right. But it was called Soder's Grocery Stores, a little tiny place back in like the 70s, right? Mm -hmm. And he had one of the, these in there. His was a plug-in model, uh, you know, that actually had a condenser and a, and, a, and a chiller inside it. This one is nice because you don't have anything to plug in. You could take this with you, you know, if you're going RVing or camping and you want to take this with you, all you got to do is load it full of ice. And because it's insulated, Deb, your stuff's going to stay cold all day. Absolutely. And the hinge lid has a lip on it. So when it closes, it closes. So you don't have to worry about, oh, I've got the meat. I've put the meat over here that's going to be going on the grill. The burgers are going to get spoiled. No. Once you've put ice in here, this is sealed. It's a stainless steel shell, all powder coated, rust resistant and weather resistant. So you don't have to worry if you take it to the beach and the, you know, the wind and the rain and all that stuff. Use it in the man cave. It's going to fill it with, you could put a rough 
roughly 70 cans of beer if you're a fan of beer. I personally would use it for champagne, ladies, because I really think that it's gorgeous and elegant enough. And what you can do, we don't have this one propped, but I think the black is fabulous for the holidays. So you can fill it with ice and full of this champagne on this side and then have clean ice on the other side There's for so your guests to take for your, yes. for your guests. It's an 80 quart capacity. It'll hold 132 pounds. You've got those heavy duty caster wheels that make mobility fantastic. And when you get to your destination, you simply lock them in place. You've got the cap, uh, you've got the little uh, drain here to drain the water so you don't even have yeah. to tip it, it'll just drain. Drains and, out. And then you've got the cap, hey. ca ta cap remover and the cap well, holder. Let's, let's take $40 off, get a brand new HSN credit card, we'll drop the price down to $179. Hey listen, I know it's not cheap, but it's worth it. It's, it's well made, it's improvements. You're gonna have this thing for years. And when people come to your house or your barbecue, they're gonna know right where to go. You don't need to bother you, hey, what do you got in the fridge? I'll be like, hey, go outside, it's in the, it's in the rolling cooler. Go get yourself something cold to drink. It's wonderful for a party. Totally. Get together, a barbecue. Uh, if, you, hey, if you're going camping and you're taking a truck, you pop this in the back of the truck, take it with you. All you gotta do is fill it with ice. That's the stainless right there. I love the little, I love the little bottle popper. I love it's it. It's great. And, right there. and you know we're talking about we're talking about adults, but this is perfect for kids. If you've got a pool or you've got an area where the kids gather, don't have them traipsing in and out of the house to get stuff out of your refrigerator, defrosting your freezer because they didn't leave the door closed. Put their stuff in here, no worries. Just put ice in there, put all their beverages in it, put their snacks in there. Then they're not going to be running in and out of the house. It doesn't matter. There's nothing that they can do. Blood Wait. orange ginger beer. <laughs> How good does that sound? I'm going well, in. It'll hold Are you thirsty? I offer you first. Uh, you know, I, I have mind. one. I would You mind. have a tip of that. You Cheers. have a tip of that because I, I got one in here. Mm. But you know what? What I, I also mind. love about this here at Cheers Team. This is kind of a gathering place, right? Yes. I used to cater parties years ago. Y'all know I came from the restaurant business. And people would gather around things like this or chafing dishes where you had hot yes. food. They would all hang out. It gives you something extra, another feature outside to look forward to when you're sitting outside, not just your grill, but you got that big party cooler, man, that everybody wants. Black, silver, or the red. Andre, I would say the red's probably the most popular. All right. Mm. That's what you said? This is good. I know it is. <laughs> Dang, All right, I'm putting mine back on. If you want the red, I got about 130. Okay. Left in the red. And then the balance is available in the stainless steel. And then we also have them in the black. I, hey, any color you get, they all have that. They all have the white uh, um, lining inside. Yes. All, all insulated. insulated. All insulated. So this is the real deal. And it'll work back beautifully if you're entertaining. Yeah. Or just it will work back to your fence. All right. If you want to get it, item number is 823759. Do not forget about our today's special. If you're looking for improvements, uh, uh, security fence, safety fence, concealment fence, beautiful fence. We have it available in a variety of colors. This is the brand new version. Much fuller, easy still, can cover any space, easy to attach, $39.95. You can't beat that, Deb. Absolutely, and you're gonna love it. Remember, all you need to do when you get it out of the box is decide where you're gonna put it and how you're going to love it because you're absolutely gonna love it. In and fact, look at it there, Deb, look at the, per what'd you say that was, Tuscany? That's Tuscany. That is your fence on a pergola. So if you've got a pergola, look how it drips down like wisteria. It would take you years to grow that, and that's going to happen right out of the box. Just have somebody place it up there and enjoy it. It's that beautiful. Beautiful Tuscany, Florida. <laughs> Lovely <laughs> Tuscany, Florida. That's what that is back there. I know how hard you're working, young lady. Thank oh, no, you so much. Oh, no, it's been a great day. I'm yeah. loving it. Well, you're getting through. We're, we're, we're getting there. Great. We've got great products. You guys are loving them. All right. Uh, thank you, Deb. So we're down to my last item in the show. Uh, I will tell you, the three-pack of garden gloves, these are the best gloves you will ever buy. They have what they call a nitrile finish on the inside. Look at how you can pick anything up with them. One size fits all. I've got bigger hands. I'm always shocked that these things fit me, but they do. Everybody that orders is gonna get a three pack of these today. You'll use them for anything, all right? Cleaning, gardening, uh, you know, grabbing, uh, uh, grabbing mulch, uh, whatever it is. They're gonna protect your hand, super stretchy, and they are washable. You get three of these, one size fits all, 20 bucks, or the best 20 bucks you'll ever spend. 
All right. So, this is my pick of the hour. Why did I make it my pick? Well, I was fascinated. I have this exact Sun Joe, but a very similar version when it first came out. I have one of these, and I was, I was so impressed because what this is going to do, you can attach it to your regular garden hose. Regular garden hose has about 50 PSI. It is battery powered, nothing to plug in. It's all recharged, all right? Plug it into your hose. It's gonna change the hose pressure from 50 to 360. Five to six times the amount of pressure so you can wash the car, wash the boat, clean out the recycle bin. It's from a company called Sunjo. Here's the battery station, no cords. You simply plug in your, uh, your garden hose, okay, underneath garden hose, and then the attachment, which is right here, okay, and I'll show you how that works in a bit. And now you have just created a pressure power hose in the power of your hand. Great Father's Day gift. It comes with all kinds of great extras like the scrub brush, hooks right on it. Great for washing your car. Here's where it gets even crazier. You can attach the siphon hose to any water supply and you can use it on here. So now I can draw water out of a lake. I can draw water out of the swimming pool if I want to clean up around the pool. I can put it in a five gallon bucket of water and I can use it. The one thing I don't need is electric cord. It's a power pressure washer without any cords. Bobby, show everybody what I'm talking about. Hey, here it is. This is our Sun Joe power sprayer. Look, I'll just get right to work and show you how easy it is. First of all, this is super light. I think it only weighs like seven pounds, but you're getting that power. You're getting up to 350 PSI right there at your fingertips. And guy, to your point, look at this. I don't have a garden hose in here. I have the siphoning hose that we give you with your purchase. I'm operating off a bucket of a water, bucket of water. Here right there. So yep. again, you're getting all this power in your hand. And you know what? I don't have to find an electrical outlet or deal with an extension cord or drag out a big heavy pressure washer. This is that perfect in-between that's why we call it our power sprayer from Sunjo. Look, if you got some windows, I'll go over here, some doors you want to get clean. Now, you can adjust the nozzle. Guy, you know how in a regular pressure washer, you got to have this nozzle for that. Yeah, because you yeah, you'll take the paint off. <laughs> all, the no all of the nozzles are built in. So look at this. I'll go here. I'm 25. Look at this. I'm going to go to the zero. I can go up, 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 all the way. This is a great way to get rid of those pest nests, clean underneath the gutters or the soffit, whatever. I can take it down. Let's do the... Uh, Let's go to here. I'm going to do the 40 right here. This is really good. Nice and gentle, especially if I'm doing something like this, right? The screens or the windows, something you... You don't want to do a pressure washer on something like this. It's more of a gentle. Get your welcome mat clean. All of this stuff, again, is because I'm using just the siphon well, hose and the battery. Guy, the battery's in here, all right? Yeah, it's protected. So Look at right that. Right inside. It's not going to get wet. Nope. That's our, hey, hey, guy, that's our Sun Joe 24 volt lithium ion battery. You know the deal. No, you can over. use that on any Sun Joe product 100. that you get here today. So, yeah. and, and I will tell you, listen, we offer pressure washers here all the time. They're a great product. The problem is you have to plug it in. You're kind of tethered there. You don't, have the, you don't have this where you can just wash your whole car, wash the walls. You have to drag the pressure washer wherever you go. And a pressure washer may be more than you need. You may not need 2,000 PSI to clean your shutters. This is 360 PSI. Regular garden hose, 50 PSI. Put your finger over it, maybe 100. This is 360 PSI. You're going to reach those second story windows. You can adjust to whatever strength you want of the pressure or whatever style that you want. You can draw the water from a lake, from the pond, from a pool, from a bucket, or you can attach your garden hose. Right there, we have it attached to a garden hose and she's cleaning out the indoor and outdoor areas around the patio. Bobby has it out by the car. Bobby, do you have it hooked up to a, to a hose or to a bucket? up to a hose out here. I started yeah. with the bucket, but now Show I've got it hooked up to the hose. But to your yeah. point, this is the perfect in-between. I mean, yeah, you can break out the regular garden hose here and get about 50 PSI and try the old, you know, thumb over it, cover it. But if you need something more powerful, this is that perfect in-between. Listen, guy, we sell these pressure washers all day long. We're the number one brand of pressure washers in the United States. But if you don't want to spend that money, you don't want to be corded, and you don't need that much pressure, this is what you go to. Oh, this yeah. is why we call it our power sprayer. Now, I got it out here on the car. I want to show you how great this is for the car. 
you know, you can now do your car wash without having to leave your house with your power sprayer. Again, battery operated, give this a few hours charge, you're gonna get 10 to 15 full continuous minutes of usage. So use your soaper if you've got one at home or you suds it up, then spray it down with your power sprayer. And look at this, I'm gonna take the uh, end piece off right here and I'm gonna attach this. This is our utility brush. This comes with it. This is nice feather bristles, good for scrubbing. So put some window cleaner on. Now you can get all the bugs and dirt and debris easily off your window because the water's still coming through pressurized and you've got the scrubbing power of the bristle brush. Then, guy, follow me down here. Take it down and get in between the wheels so you can scrub all that brake dust, all that nasty dirt and grime that gets down underneath there. This is the way you do it. Again, if you've got a garden hose, use that. If you're somewhere mobile, if you're by the boat dock or you're hiking, biking, you wanna clean off, you're at the beach, you can just use the siphon hose and a bucket of fresh water and you are good to go. All right, if you wanna get it, I love this too. If you're, uh, if you're just camping somewhere and you got a bucket, right? And you just want to wash, you want to wash off the bikes or whatever it is. All you need to do is just fill the bucket and drop the siphon in. You don't need a garden hose. So any water source, I was thinking about like if you're at the beach and you got a, you know, a couple of gallon jugs of water and you want to rinse off the kid's feet before they get in the car, you can do that. Uh, you know, put, you can take it out to the end of your dock, wherever, and you can draw the water right out of the ocean if you want to clean off your fishing area. Great Father's Day gift. To Bobby's point, lightweight. All you do is attach your water supply, pull the trigger and go, pop in the battery, all right? And you're getting 20, 25 minutes of runtime. That's fantastic. So if you want to wash the car, this is the way to do it. Lightweight, easy. You know, like I said, I'm not poo-pooing pressure washers. They're great, but pressure washers are usually another $100. Oh, yeah. And that's a big deal to haul it out because you got to plug it in, attach the water supply, and then it's, you got to take it wherever you go. It's heavy. Yeah. You know what, uh, and I'm showing you an example on this PVC, this, this fence back here, you can see how easily it's getting off the dirt and the grime. I'm backed up to the, uh, hooked up with the hose, so I'm getting about, you know, 325 to 360 PSI. You know what my wife and I have been using this for in our back patio? We don't want to drag the big pressure washer back there. Our dog has been getting, digging up and doing a lot of digging like dogs Making do. Making a mess. All the paw prints. So I'm not bringing the big pressure washer from the garage. Right. I just have this backed out there with a bucket of water oh, yeah. and hose it right off. If you've got patio pavers or wood decking, look how quickly and easily this comes off. Not every job requires you to get out a 2,000 PSI pressure washer. I mean, if you can see what this does just with 350 PSI, you're like, you know what? For that price, yeah. battery operated. Listen, I'm not tethered. This makes a lot of sense to me, and it made a lot of sense to my wife and I. That's why we use this in the well, back. And Bobby, uh, I think a lot of people get intimidated by a big pressure washer, right? They do, yeah. And, and then where do you put it? It takes up about four times the amount of space, maybe more. And if you're just cleaning delicate things like your furniture, you don't need 1,500 to 2,000 PSI. No. This is six times the amount of pressure that you're gonna get over a garden nose. It's enough, and with that concentrator adjustable nozzle, Bobby. Yeah, I'm showing you right now. All the you can use it for a variety of different surfaces. That's the jet spray if you want the most intense. This is kind of kicked back a little bit notch. Still an intense jet spray. Then you've got a kind of a flowering spray a 40% fan and a 25 degree angle fan. But let's go to the flowering. You know what, this is nice and gentle. If you just want to water the flowers, you could do this in your entire front yard, backyard with just a power sprayer. Maybe you're hooked up to the hose. I mean, you probably yeah. would be if you're at your home, but you could do it again with just a bucket of water. It's the same pressure. I mean, guy, look, you don't really, you don't, you don't notice much of a, a drawback. I mean, this, wow. I think, average is about 275. I like washing windows. Yeah. I, I think, honestly, if you bought this just to wash your windows, think about how much time that would save you, right? And you can use whatever it is you want to wash them and rinse them. It's up to you. But look at how easy. All she's got that attached to is a hose. And like I said, you can use a bucket of water. It is that easy. So it's our weekly deal drop. We've already dropped the price from $99.95 to $75. That's great. If you have a brand new HSN credit card, we'll drop the price down to $35. Uh, when you get a brand new card, you get $40 in your account. And that'll lower your, your flex pay. Your flex pay will be just, a, you know, 10, 12 bucks, right? Get it home. Great Father's Day, great Mother's Day. Clean it yourself. Do it yourself the right way. It's never been easier. 691-879 is the item number if you want to pick it up. Bobby, I'm telling you, 
Uh, for the price? Yeah. You this, gotta get it. I love the deal. And, and they were showing you the car washing aspect. How much did you spend in your last car wash? My last drive through car wash was 10 bucks. You know, you do two, three, four of those That's in cheap. a month. Yeah. You know, a couple months, you've paid for this. Now you can do your own car wash right in your front driveway without even leaving the house. Matter of fact, without even using a gardening hose if you don't have one or don't want to. But this is perfect, flexible, lightweight, and powerful up to 350 PSI. My favorite place, the beach. You know all the stuff gets sandy, the coolers, the sand. Oh, yeah, the boots, man. All that stuff. Clean it off. Use this and the fresh waters just to clean off all those sandy items for the kids. It's amazing. All right, we are very busy. 691879. If you want to grab one of these for Father's Day, Mother's Day, every day, any day, get it. You love it. Thank you, Bobby. Absolutely. Great job, my friend. All right, let's go over to the mailbox. So our question was, if you bought the Today Special, how would you use it? In what fashion would you use it? it hey, guy. Yeah. You've got mail. All right, let's see who our winner is. $25. Uh, she says, I use mine to keep the mailman to stop walking through my drug, <laughs> walking through my garden. So a little blockade fence. And that money goes to Debbie. Debbie, why you are winning $25, my dear. So congratulations. You guys have a great day. I will be back tomorrow at 4 p.m. I think it's Professor Amos. Stick around because the amazing, the wonderful, the lovely Helen Keeney is coming your way next. Here she comes. Well, good afternoon.